Uh, I, I absolutely hate hooking a PTO shaft up to the tractor. Uh, because over the years, the PTO system was, originally the PTO system was open, you put a shaft up on it, you sl and, and it was really easy to work. But due to safety, you know, restraints and laws and litigation, uh, all of the tractors have, and basically all the PTOs have now been covered in shielding. And that shielding makes it actually harder, it kind of defeats the purpose of a PTO shaft, which was easily slipped upon. So now we had to come up with some different types. Uh, there's different ways of hooking the PTO up that's a lot easier. You gotta understand that that PTO, uh, the original PTO shaft is well over 100 years old technology. So Small Farms Innovation sent me a PTO quick attach. Now I'm gonna say this up front, we are not sponsored by Small Farms Innovation. Uh, we do not get paid by Small Farms Innovation. Phil at Fall, Small Farms Innovation is my friend. And he sent me one of these and said, hey, I want you to test this out and tell me what you think about it. So we're gonna do exactly like that. He has the full understanding that I get to say what I truly think. And that's what really friends are about. However, he confidently sent me this attachment. So let's get, I'm gonna, let's break it down and show it to you. All right, before we start putting this on the tractor, I'm gonna show you how easy it is. It really, is, it's gonna be a short video. I do wanna show you this. It's got threaded, uh, threaded holes here. And what this is for is for like if you're gonna if you're gonna do like a bat wing something 100 horsepower you're gonna you put the bat wing on it's gonna stay on for a long time you go ahead and you stab this thing and then you just run these bolts up and it's gonna guarantee that it's not gonna come apart not that it's gonna come apart anyway but let's just say for example you get into some briars uh, something like that and there is a possibility that you could pull this off put in the the bolts together uh, in here for like you know, dangerous type stuff like being in vines and you know, that kind of environment. It just makes sense to go ahead and put the bolts in and make it a permanent mount. Especially if you're gonna take your bat wing and you're gonna run the bat wing for two weeks. It's easy to hook the bat wing up, put the two bolts in it. It makes it, it, makes it a permanent connection. And then when you get done, you take the two bo bolts out and you're done. For what we do here with 50 horsepower tractors, the pins are probably gonna be, you know, everything we got is 50 horsepower and below. So the pins were gonna be probably good enough for us. Don't see, don't think we're gonna have any issues. All right, so with this system, you're gonna have to do this one time. You're gonna slide it up on, push the button, lock it into place. Because of the way it's made, it's just a lot easier to do. Then, you know, it's not big around as this shaft and heavy and you're not trying to do all that at once. So we've got this on, it's locked on, it's permanent. So the next thing you're gonna do is you're just gonna take the PTO adapter and you're gonna push the button on your, your PTO and rotate it around until you find that point that slips in. And then now that's locked into place. As I said before, you wanna make sure that your PTO is in a, in a neutral position so that it'll rotate freely. Uh, just this flail mower's teeth are probably close to the ground. Uh, you don't wanna to have to try to rotate that flail mower over. All right, so we've got the PTO shaft where it'll rotate freely. You just take the spikes, put them in the holes, slide them on. That is it. That is exactly how hard it is. There, that was all done in one take, so you know I didn't fake it. Put the pins in, and or like I said, you can put the bolts. Put our safety pin, our safety chain back on, and we're good to go. All right, to take this thing off, it's just as easy. You're gonna pull the pins. So we take that, the last pin out, and as hard as it has to be is you grab the collar, pull it back, and that is that. I'm gonna leave a link to Small Farms Innovations website here at the bottom of the video in the description. So you can click on it and reach out to them if you're interested in these. Again, I do not get paid anything for doing this. I do, however, think this is a fine product and probably one of the, I'm gonna ease out there and say this is probably the, the easiest uh, PTO quick adapter on the market right now.